great. Um, so Lawrence, um, you're next up on our on our hands list, and then we'll uh, start getting back through folks. I know um, uh, Robert, Deb, and Bernard, you still have your hands up as well. Um, so we'll, we'll get back to you. But Lawrence, um, you're self-muted as well as the unmute that I've just given you, so you should be good to go now. Hello, how are you? Doing well, how are you? Good. Uh, thank you for putting on this presentation. Uh, all the revisions that I've seen you guys made have definitely been an improvement. Uh, so thank you for that. Two safety concerns that I can think of, and it's it's in your jurisdiction, but you haven't really done anything, is the South Street. The South Street intersection is known for bad accidents. There was just one a couple months ago that was pretty bad and it made the front new, uh, front page of the newspaper. Is there any thought on how to make that safer? That's a great question. Um, so South Street, maybe for folks who don't know, is down closer to the, uh, the interchange with I-95. It's a signalized intersection with two lanes in each direction. Um, there it was it was looked at as being incorporated as part of the road diet pilot and just because of the proximity to the interchange and the volumes that were observed at that location that um based off our analysis um and the the uh the modeling that we did uh it wouldn't it wouldn't function as as well that's not to say that some changes could not be made there um, so I had mentioned earlier about the drainage issue and how, for the most part, we're keeping the existing the curb width uh, maintained throughout the corridor. Um, and so I think in that spirit of trying to maintain the corridor, there wasn't anything that we could do as part of this resurfacing project. That's not to say, though, that something uh, further couldn't be developed uh, to improve safety at that intersection. We mentioned that that's a priority of ours at the DOT. Um, and would certainly work with the town uh, going forward on any improvements that could be made at that South Street intersection. Um, so thank you for the comment. I think it's something that we can consider going forward. One of the vehicles has the airbag deployment, another vehicle is smoking, and we have Sonam police coming to assist with them.